In a letter written to the Katima Mlilo Town Council's chief executive officer, NDP accused Watson Kalaloka of, amongst others, tarnishing the name and image of the party, failing to honor a 30% stop order agreement to the party, failing to submit monthly reports to the party, as well as failing to give feedback on matters discussed in council chambers. What led to that, perhaps you still remember the street vendors who demonstrated. There were complaints, and when they reached the party, we formed a committee to investigate those complaints. It was led by Raspo Mwemba. Investigations were carried out with recommendations given in the end. Kalaluka appeared before the disciplinary committee, and it was after that that NDP said recommendation for his removal was made. Recommendations were given and in the end he was found guilty of the issues he was accused of. After the investigations concluded, they recommended that the party should remove him immediately and replace him with brave Mukendwa. It indeed happened. Lukato says the party has since instructed Kalaluka to refrain from attending the council meetings and activities while the party awaits a response from the town council about his replacement in office. He was speaking during a media conference that was aimed at encouraging Viva. people to join the party Viva. ahead of the 2024 Viva. general elections. Juliet Sveso, NBC News, Katima Malilo.